Hey guys, it's me Drew and I'm back for another video. Today is going to be a really simple video of a get ready with me featuring Glossier. Um, Glossier is about skin first, makeup second. Very, very natural, natural makeup. Very, very simple stuff. Nothing that's going to give you a crazy amount of coverage. So I do use a couple other brands products, but let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing I do like to do on these days is start with a primer. This is the Laura Mercier foundation primer oil free Oops. so I just like to take a little bit of the primer and just blend that into my skin very very simple like I said not much to this this uh, routine at all it's very 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 simple so just blend that in let that sit for a few seconds. Um, while that's sitting and drying, um, I want to say Glossy A is an incredible company. It really, really is. Their products are awesome. I should. I need to do a whole entire review on them. But just very simple. Just makes you look better. It's just really, 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 really cool stuff. And there will be a link in the description bar below. And you can get 20% off your first order. So definitely use that link if you have never tried Glossy A. But the first step I'm going to use is their Glossier Perfecting Skin Tint, and I am in the shade Light. It's really cool. You get a little pack of stickers. I actually have a pack right here so you can see. But you get a pack of stickers that you can decorate your packaging with. It's very, very cool stuff. So I like to shake this, and I literally just drop some. It's very thin, like all over my skin, just like that. It's very, very hard to see. And then I just use my fingers and just really blend it in. It's not going to be crazy coverage at all. It's really just going to just make your skin look less red almost. It's really, really nice. It's just a simple, simple thing. And if you do accidentally order like a shade lighter or darker, you really aren't going to notice because it really just blends right in. I have my mirror over here. So yeah, it just blends really simply right in as you can see nothing too crazy love the perfecting skin tint then i go ahead with a concealer and this is the glossier stretch concealer now the glossier stretch concealer is really cool this is also in light i just take a teeny bit it's a very very th thin um product and i just do it right under my eyes just to really brighten up that under eye area nothing too crazy and then on a couple blemishes that I have just to really cover them up as you can see it's really nothing nothing too crazy I really really like that and then I do go ahead and set the whole entire thing with the it cosmetic celebration foundation in the shade light medium so I go ahead and take that my cap my thing's not, doesn't work, but. And then I go ahead and use the brush that came with it, which is right here. My whole entire thing, like before work or anything, takes about five minutes. I can really get it knocked out. So, very light. I'll just go ahead and pat this all over the skin. But it's very, very light coverage. I really, really like that. And like you can still see like my pimples, you can still see my moles, my birthmarks, any imperfections on my skin, but it really just makes the overall complexion look good, which is what I really like. Now I really need to invest in a really, really nice video camera because this makes me look super pale and I'm definitely not that pale. So just like that, very simple. And then what I like to do is I like to go ahead and take this big um, brush with a little bit of Benefit Hula Bronzer, nothing crazy. And I just tap off the excess and just swirl right here and then up. So just the outside of my face and then bring down the neck. And it really just warms up my face. It's nothing, nothing crazy. 
like I said, I'm really just warming up my face. And I really notice though, like I'm like, oh, I don't really notice anything. But when I don't have it on, it's a big difference. It just really makes me look a lot more pale. Even though I'm not really pale, but it's just like that. You guys can see it's nothing too crazy. Just very, very, very simple, simple stuff. Next, I'm going to go ahead and take the Halo Scope, which is their version of a highlighter. Now, there's two shades. There's Quartz, which is right here. This is Quartz. It's not going to focus. So it's just a very, very light, light color. And then this one is called Topaz, which is more of a darker color. And I'll go ahead and swatch both of them for you. So very, very, very subtle. The Quartz is a lot more, or the Topaz is a lot more pigmented, as you can see. I don't really use this unless I'm super, super tan. So I tend to use the Quartz and literally just, boop, just like that, and then so literally just nothing too crazy just like a C shape and then I just blend that in and it really just is gonna pick up the light very 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 subtly nothing like wearing a regular highlighter so it's just very 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 simple which is what I like I'm all about the simplicity anymore I really like that so as you can see it's nothing crazy at all very 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 simple then I'm gonna go ahead and set my face with the Laura Mercier translucent setting powder which I really really love um, and, a, and a big brush just tap off and just but most people when they see me they don't even say wow your makeup looks really really good they just say wow you have really nice skin I'm like, thanks, because it's really not makeup. I mean, it is, but it's not what anybody would ever consider makeup. And I mean, sure, I take really good care of my skin. I need to do a skincare routine for you guys soon, too. But for the most part, it's just very simple stuff. I like my new haircut, too. I just got it done yesterday. So there's that. So it does very simple, simple, simple. And then the last product is also from Glossier. This is their Boy Brow. Let's see if this is going to focus for you guys. Boy Brow. It's awesome. Um, it's more like a gel pomade for the brows. Um, it actually won a Lore Best Brow Pomade product last this year. So pretty cool. So I literally just comb it right through my brows. So you can really see the difference right here, which one has it and which one doesn't. But it is extremely subtle. Like, I mean, it is crazy when you look at it, but once it settles in, it really, really looks nice. So those are intense. And then I like to take just a plain spoolie just to comb through and really get all the product through everything just like that so like I said very 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 simple simple just dropped everything pardon me but it's a very, very, very simple routine, and I will just finish it off with a little bit of Glossier's Balm.com. The Mint Balm.com is my absolute favorite. It actually has some menthol in there, so it's going to be really cooling, too. So, just put a little bit of that on, and that is it. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Like I said, if you want to try Glossier products, which I highly recommend, they are incredible. There are three new super serums I've been um, playing around with and really, really loving. Um, yeah. So if you like this video, don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Use that link below to save yourself 20% off. And let me know what you try. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.